If you Google Geisha and Cat, numerous Utagawa Kuniyoshi wood blocks pop up. One of my favorites is Geisha spanks a cat for making off with a fish. And today I am painting this image on a Starbucks canvas bag. I put a little piece of cardboard inside of the pocket that I am painting today. Not only does this keep the paint from bleeding through to the inside of the canvas, but it provides a little bit of support for my paintbrush. Starting off with a Too Soft White mix, both from Angelus Direct. Soft must always be heat set for three to four minutes and there is an Angelus Direct discount link down below so you can get this exact same heat gun. Pour a tiny bit of pale blue into the original Too Soft white mix as well as a little bit more of the Too Soft. This is the second layer on this canvas bag. This is again pale blue, this time not quite mixed with the Too Soft. Because I have a brand new fresh straight edge paintbrush, I'm going to take advantage of it and utilize the straight line and produce some really nice straight white stripes. This is the Geisha Spanking a Cat printed out on plain old paper. I have a glued to blue Sorrel transfer paper. All I need to do is press down on what is already printed and then I have perfect line work to follow. I will be painting a pattern on top of this kimono, but first I need to do the background blends. These are a mix of navy blue, blue, and pale blue. Geisha skin tones, I chose vanilla. Mm -hmm. 
I also chose vanilla for the naughty fish stealing cat. I'm freehanding all of these kimono patterns. If you look online, there are numerous to choose from. You can also use the original stencil if you still have it. You just lay it on top of the kimono and you have your line work to reproduce. Most of my dark line work is in a calligraphy style. It was not my intention. However, I do like the way it looks. And this is the complete Udagawa Kuniyoshi inspired geisha spanking a cat making off with a fish painted on a Starbucks canvas bag. If you have any questions, all of my contact information is down below as are links to all the products I use in this video. Big thanks to Angela's Drake for the paints and thanks guys for watching.